All right, a quick update on CASPA here. So overall, CASPA is still making higher highs and higher lows. Very bullish looking chart here. Keeping it real simple, as from the last update, you're down 4% on the week here. And you're still holding from the low here to the high. You're still holding over the 3.82. So as long as you're over 15.8, you are bullish to continue pushing higher at some point. And it looks extremely well off of that very large wick. So hopefully you guys paid attention and bought this huge dip here uh, because the price may never come back down to those levels. Now, as long as you hold 15.8, the next price to beat is 17.5 here, about a 9% move up. Then once you get over that, you can take on that high once again at about 2.08 here. And that is a 30% move almost. And then once we get through that, we'll shoot for a new high. Now, with that being said, if for some reason the price does end up breaking down below the 382, which uh, I've already mentioned, this does look extremely well as a bottom being put in and it is bullish over that price, then of course the price would end up dropping to the 0.5 here. So if you fall and you get a weekly close below 15.8, you're currently at 16.1 then you would have the price drop in the other direction about nine, ten percent down to 14.5 here. Now, with all that being said, how high can this thing go this cycle? Uh, of course, we do have one target up here that we drew a while back. Just to give you guys a visual, if you think Casper is going to hit five dollars, that's going to give you about a hundred and nineteen billion dollar market cap. And from today, let me move this down just a hair because it's not exactly accurate. You're looking at about a 31x on your investment here. So. What are your thoughts on that? None of this is financial advice. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.